Hi, my name is Maddie Caldwell, and this year I took the project All About Dogs. In this project, I earned the blue ribbon, the superior ribbon, and I would have gone to State Fair if we had it. In this project, I learned how to better take care of my dog and how to understand him more. An example of this would be in section four. We learned how to understand their body language and how that relates to their emotions and our safety around that dog. This year, I went with a virtual option for judging, so I had to also create my tri board virtually. I used a slideshow format to present my tri board ideas to the judge, and I used extra slides to show more in depth information to the judge. I also completed all of the more challenges in my project book. This included researching a dog that made an impact on history. I chose a dog that was the first dog in space. The other more challenges I completed consisted of writing a story about a fictional dog or making an advertising flyer for a certain dog breed explaining all of their characteristics and the people that would most likely buy that dog. I had to explain the behavior of a dog that I had just met and how they reacted to my being there. I also had to name the parts of a dog that people had in common with them or that other animals had in common with them. I also got to have a very fun experience by visiting a pet store and looking at some fun items that are not necessary for a dog's survival but are fun to have in case you want to have fun with your dog. I also explored the different coat varieties of dog breeds like curly and smooth and wire hair, which was very fun because I got to finally learn that my dog was wire hair instead of curly, which he should be. An extra activity I completed for this project was to talk to a veterinarian about this project. Most people know they shouldn't feed their dog chocolate, but a lot of people have no idea that grapes and raisins are really toxic to dogs. So I asked her a few questions that I had involving some of the activities I completed, and she was very helpful. Lastly, one of the requirements for my project was to make a demonstration for my club. And right below his neck, where his shoulder blades meet, that's called his withers, so right in here. I chose to show them all of the parts of a dog using my dog as a model. Pretty much the crown of his head. Shadow. I hope this sparks some interest in some of you. If you really like dogs, I highly recommend this project. Thank you for your time.